Team Molivas going, you know what? Let, let's try it. Why not? We had Pike last match. Let's just try this. And then we see the uh, the Ezreal and the Alistair come through. So okay. Superiority definitely wanting that Ezreal coming through once again. Uh, and obviously Superiority, it looks like they've actually got some different players in here uh, this time around also. And we got we got that. We got that Alistar with that Ezreal. Ezreal did do very good for Superiority. It's understandable why would they keep him. And then they get the Alistar. Braum just wasn't doing enough. So they got the... I'm going to say it for him. He's very voluptuous, I would say. Alistar is a, is a beautiful big being and um you know i i know big words too blam so you know alistar is, is a great safe pick to have twitch is gonna be the problem though he shreds through people late game with his passive and his poison so i don't know you're looking for that early game i guess and but we have to see if that twitch is jungle or adc that is the that is the question on superiority's mind it's a question on my mind it's a question on my cat's mind where is that rat going and what is he doing here no. Definitely, definitely. I mean, most times at a 10 on the red side as well, you generally get those two flex picks also. So, yep. I mean, as flexible as Malphite and Twitch can get, they're not the most flexible of picks. You can kind of guess where they're going to go. But we see the Zed come through as well. It wasn't yesterday that we saw Molivas play the Zed jungle. We did actually see Putty Putty play Zed jungle. So whether they're going to try and reciprocate it today is going to be an interesting one. Zed is obviously massive. Uh, Zed jungle, yes. sorry, is obviously massive within Mena and EU region. So it'd be very nice to see that come through. But once again, we're just seeing superiority Ooh. going full. Who's like their front line? It's lining it up for Mr. Ezreal. Possibly the Diana. We did see them flirt with the Galio pick, which would be massive, having yeah. two global ultimates on the two side of blue team, blue team. Nice. But I don't think they're going to go for too much tank because no. by the looks of it, we've got the knockup potential from the mouth with the Yasuo as well. Yeah, uh, you've got Zed good. being able to get mm -hmm. in and out of there. And then, as you said, with a Twitch, just procting that uh, damage over time with the dots. It's going to be absolutely crazy. And they're locking the scene. So, like yeah. I said... We're seeing Mo okay. just having a bit of fun with their yeah. drafts, it seems. That is a very interesting build. The co Like you said, that combo is disgusting. The Malphite ult into a Yasuo ult is going to be mm. the nightmare of superiority. They should be talking about it right now, preparing to say, all right, guys, no, it, it's COVID regulations. Everyone stands six feet apart from one another. No one jumble up together. You can't have this happen. Because if it does, you're kind of dead. You get that combo, you're stuck in the air for three, four seconds, and Twitch is proccing his passive on you at the same time in those team fights. It's, it's nightmare-inducing. So you don't want to be too close to one another when that all goes down. But, you know, it's it's still good. Because you have that Shen, you have that Alistar, and you have that Mundo. They went even bigger this time. Somehow they got an even bigger team composition. Yeah, you can only hope Mario on Alistair is going to be able to knock out the yeah. likes of the Zed uh, into these uh, squishy front li uh, backline mm -hmm. champions like the Ezreal and the Ari. I suppose that's going to be his complete role within this matchup. Uh, Shen offering that massive shield also. So we're probably going to be seeing the likes of Serpent Fang being built on one of these champions on uh, Moaliva's team. And then Mundo, we do love to see a good Mundo. Generally not one of the most go-to picks in the Baron lane. But hey-ho, they're having a bit of a change around in the team comp here. So Fish of Villa is going... Villa of Fish, sorry, is going in a Baron lane. And then Hitman is going in the jungle here as well. So a little bit of a change there on the side of Mo Levers also. And this bot lane is going to be fun to watch. <laughs> very, mm -hmm. very fun to watch, in my opinion. We're going to see that Sin support with a Yasuo ADC. I... I don't think I've ever actually seen this combo together. I've seen a Yasuo ADC and I've seen a Singe support, but I haven't seen them in the same room. So, let's see how that works out. It's it's actually, uh, the Singe throw doesn't work with a Yasuo ult, if I believe. So, it doesn't necessarily work together. I, I don't know. I don't know. Yeah. It's going to be interesting to see what happens there in that mid lane. Obviously, yeah. <laughs> they don't really have any range. Uh, Alistair's not quite made his way down into that bot lane yet, but it's okay. Ezreal has that poke potential to keep himself out of range of the Yasuo knockup. Or even getting a little yoint over his shoulders. A boy uh, singed. But, uh, yeah. yeah, it's a very, very weird one. It's a very weird match. 
I definitely feel Mo like Mundo should playing this very this weird laning phase, especially against the Malphite. His poke mm. is too strong. It goes right through Malphite's shield, and then he wins the all-ins. So um, Mundo is definitely going to be a priority for this Twitch jungle to gank, I would say. But mm. anything can happen, and Alistar are getting thrown over the shoulder. Somehow Singe lifting a 7,000-foot cow over his shoulder. He gets him to oh, one oh. health. He flashes out and survives another oh. throw, but he's oh. low. Look at this Yasuo. He's going to go down. Oh. There's the first blood with Ezreal. There's the double kill with Ezreal, and they've turned it around. They got first blooded last game. Now they get the double kill within the first minute, and now superiority is looking very, very good right now. Again, this all-in by this Mundo taking a lot of damage from these minions, but doing a lot of damage back. It's 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 a, it's a stalemate. It's a stalemate. Okay. Yeah, that double kill down in the bot lane definitely had me sounding like an excited old lady waiting for a bus to appear. Um, <laughs> but yeah, we saw that superiority were literally just making. Uh, just making lemonade out of what Singe tried to do. So I was going to comment on Mario possibly being forced into the fight. So with the Alistair being able to try and push one of these champions out of the fights, but then Singe be able to throw him further mm -hmm. away from his allies. Uh, we saw that happen down in the bot lane, but then we also saw that the Ezreal popped off. He did get thrown as well by yep. the Singe, but it kind of worked out in his favor. Once again, 1v1, Mundo and Ooh. the Mal. And we see Shen getting in there a little bit late. Forcing the flash onto Mundo, getting that kill in the Baron lane. So, once yeah, again, a little bit more of a fun, a little bit more of a fun pick here for Molevers. But yeah. I mean, it's kind of working for superiority. But I think Molevers could just turn on the switch if they wanted to. Yeah, and we didn't see it, but in the top of the map, Zed did get the kill on Mundo. He caught him very well with his Ws, able to teleport with ease. Look at this push. You know, bot lane, they're down in gold, but they don't care. They're still going to hard push this lane. They know Shen's up top. There's nothing to be ganked for. A flash. Oh, he's got uh, Hextech flash on Sin, so he's able to flash with ease constantly. Ooh. Another throw. Oh, nice. a great push by the nice. uh, Alistar. Sin goes under turret, takes a lot of damage. Alistar, Ari now coming in with the gank, and there's another double kill happening in the bot lane. Yasuo and Singe go down. I can see why I don't see Yasuo and Singe in the same lane together. They are not doing the best right now. A thousand gold lead for Ar uh, for Ezreal, excuse me. And Ari is actually a little bit behind this Zed because Zed's on his own getting a lot of ganks as well. But, you know, it's it's, it's gank city, baby. Gank, yeah, gank city. I mean, between the two, between Zed and the, uh, the, the Ari, they have generally good wave clear anyway. Uh, but we do see that Alistair is rotated up into the mid lane, looking to support that Ari. It looks like Singe has some vengeance for Ori coming down and doing the duo lane dirty. We're seeing Zed potentially rotating to make that Baron lane a 1v1 into a 2v1 and the potential kill once again. But he has decided to retreat, but we do see that Twitch is on the way there as well, looking for a 2v1. But then we also see something going up in the dual lane as Look well. But we switch to the Baron lane, and I Twitch. think it's going to be a little bit too late here for Mundo. Oh, no, he managed to get it. I better see Spirit Massage being built on this Mundo. Second item, that Twitch is going to be doing a lot of damage once he gets his Ravadons into, uh, mm. I believe, uh, what's that other item? The attack speed item? Give me, give me a hint, Blam. Give me a hint. Nash or his tooth. Yeah, Blam didn't help me. I got no help from no one. I came up with it I myself. I didn't know who you were talking about. I was just staring at <laughs> the board, like, attack speed, attack speed, attack speed. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's all I got. Basically, yeah, we're seeing that Twitch go AP, which is a staple for Twitch jungle. You know, he's going to farm and do his thing. It's actually weird to see. Twitch has no ganks, no assists, no kills right now. And that's very good to see because, you know, you don't want him to, to go ahead. And now, because he's so far behind, they're going to be able to take this uh, Rift Herald by themselves. There it is. Shen smiting it just in time. Singed, he ults. I don't know what he's going for, though. Oh, look at this. They got 4v4 right now. We're looking at a good little team fight right now. A lot of damage being done onto this Moomoo. Alistar goes down, Malphite with a nice little ult, but there's no follow-up. There's nothing that could be done. Alistar shoots the big rock boy away. He's gonna go down, though. The passive off Twitch, he gets his first kill. There's another tornado getting put on this Ari. She goes down as well. There's one kill getting done by Shen. He gets a kill. Zed's going down, but 
they lost that team fight. Another one with the Yasuo ult onto Shen and he goes down. That's a three for one for Mo Levers. They did lose Rift Herald and they're going to lose a lot of plates on this turret in bot lane for this Ezreal. But I mean, yeah, I think that's a massive play. Good. Yeah. Massive play there. Uh, I think even though, yeah, Mobile, Mobile Leavers uh, managed to get a few kills within that interaction, uh, for Israel himself, being able to take a few of those uh, gold play ins off of the turret is going to be massive for him anyway, in terms of purchasing uh, items, doing more damage. And we saw that Israel all fly through from down the bot lane into the mid lane into that river action as well, doing a bit of action towards and damage towards the enemy team. But there is a lot of alley oops going on. You've got yeah. Alistair pushing people, you've got Singe <laughs> throwing people, you've got Yasuo knocking up people. You just see oh, people Mundo. flying left, right, and center. Oh, Mundo, honey. Oh, or he was going for that blown. turret. He had nothing else. But while he was getting that turret, blue team getting Ice Dragon, and they're going to get another kill on the Ooh. Singed. Alistar, he's not even doing the stun combo. He's just pushing people away and killing them at the same time. Now he's trying to hold off for his team, but Ari is getting shoved in. She escapes with her ultimate. Mumu, Alistar at low health. He's just taking every auto attack he can from this Twitch. He's very, very low, but he survives even throughout that, all that Twitch damage. They're going to be pushing. They want this turret. Zed going with a Ooh. little teleport, but he got greedy and he goes down. Ari is doing a lot of damage right now. She is... She's not fed, but she is strong, and that is good to see because Zed... Zed is at the same amount of gold, but he's getting caught. He's got two two deaths, but he's also got two kills. But he's an assassin. He's not helped necessarily too much with the team. Ari's got her charm going. A little two big boys against Singed. Is it enough? Oh, the flash. It's not enough. Oh my not god. Quite. The not quite. damage We're seeing by the airborne. Twitch. We're seeing the taunts from Shen. Malfe goes uh -oh. Very They're gonna well. turn around we real quick. In trying to take out the Ori also. Oh, doing he's half going down. Her health there goes the move. Alistair. Yasuo is going in. Oh, is he going to get a double kill here? Is he going for he's it? Oh, Ari doesn't. survives. Ooh. Uh, Ari's playing out of her mind right now. She's doing a lot of damage. She's ducking. She's weaving. She's juking. She should be in the uh, the the ultimate tag uh, matches on ESPN should be in dodgeball. right now. Should be in dodgeball. <laughs> She's definitely using the five Ds of dodge. <laughs> She's definitely dipping. She's definitely ducking. She's definitely dodging. She's definitely doing the other two Ds. Um, I'm not too sure. I'm pretty sure two of them are dodge. Dip, dive, dip. Ah, dip. Oh. Yeah, dip and dive. There we go. <laughs> dip, 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 dip. Uh, <laughs> but yeah, she's doing fantastic. She has the loot and echo, so for the fla uh, splash damage into these team fights, so it's going to oh, seem like she's doing more damage. Mundo is as getting caught. Oh! Does. Quick little this, kill. Uh, His. Bit of a mistake there. His Sunfire is doing so much damage, he misses the axe. Oh, that would have been huge if he hit it. Ari can't land the charm because he's got the movement speed. Oh, if Mundo hit that, that would have been an easy double kill for superiority. But they have a commanding lead right now. Not as commanding as, you know, Mo Leaver's last game, but it's still something. They have Ice Dragon. They, ha they got Rift Herald. They got turrets. They have a little bit of vision on the enemy jungle. You know, they're, they're doing a lot better so much better they their laning phase went very 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 well there we go one more berry that just for them just for them they deserve it very 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 well <laughs> sorry miss jackson it seems <laughs> but uh i am for real Mon yeah mundo and the yasuo going a little bit head to head here he's gonna be watching yeah. out because oh. the zed is rotating yeah. It's I, possible. If I'm I mean, Zed, Zed, I wouldn't even go out. for this. Zed did not yeah, learn his lesson Zed. in that last gank. Look we've at him. seen him take out the Mundo before, but he didn't quite manage to get the, the last Mundo time. last it. time. He's Mundo with a great he's W, the flash it. out. Oh, nice little juke, but it's yeah, not going to be enough. I think he's going down here, Shen's. Yep. It's Shen and Mundo's time to shine. They're doing great right now. Oh, the flash by the Singed into the... Grounded stun on Ari, but she's gonna have stasis and flash out. She gets away. The great play by Singed goes unnoticed, unfortunately. Ari able to do her thing. Alistar, 3v2 oh. right now. The ult by Malphite. A oh. stun by Mumu. Alistar is gonna go down, or Ezreal's gonna go down. Excuse me. 
Alistar is not being focused right now. Great job by Mo Levers to focus what they need to focus right now. But now, Twitch doing so much damage right now. Two, not even two Crazy. items being built. It's just, it's insane. Wow. Okay, Nashor's Tooth doing a lot of damage. But now, we got the Mundo coming in, baby. He's looking. Oh, but he's getting kited. Yasuo doing a lot of damage and being able to get away, I think. And ulting Mundo. Oh, oh, oh. the damage oh, right there. Wow. How did Yasuo die within that whole interaction? We saw the knock up onto the Mundo. Mundo just came back there and was like, nah, you're dead, bro. Yeah. Literally wow. launches Cleaver at the Yasuo. Yasuo goes down. And this is going to set up nicely nothing. for that dragon. Infernal Dragon is up. Twitch recalled. And I think that dragon will go Ooh. down before Twitch can even get in and have a piece of the action. Ari's there. Ezreal's there. Alistair's here. There's a lot going on. He may steal oh. it. He doesn't. We, oh, he he smited early. He smited early, but they still got it. They It was down to 167, Rookie. but he still did enough damage to get it done, even with Singe's little passive aura going around there. Unfortunate for Molevers, that could have been a very good steal right there. But hey, there's still one more dragon, baby. I, I you know, anything's one more possible. Dragon. One more dragon. One more dragon and in the then, dream no. for team yes. superiority. And I think this one is a great dragon. combo to have Ice Dragon and Inferno Dragon. You deal, mm. I believe it's 4% uh, more damage, and you have 12 ability haste, which is very, very huge, especially when you yeah. have an Alistar on the team to be able to stun them to death. Look at this. 3v2. Malphite trying to kite the Ari. He's going to fl uh, flash for his life right now. Mo Alistar Ooh. getting a kill. Twitch doing a lot of damage, but it's a Mundo and an Alistar. You know, like, that's a, a brick house and um another brick house. It's not even a... It's just two brick houses put together, and Twitch can't blow to break them down to save his life. So they're going to get away. They're going to do what they need. Oh, no! <laughs> Malphite getting caught in the bush and goes down. He tried to run for his life, but that's not enough. Yeah, it was I a mean, brick house Oreo. I think that was, that's what I was uh, <laughs> the thing you was going. That was the concept I think you was going for there. We was the, the brick house Oreo. Yeah. yeah, let's say that. That's that's exactly what I had in mind. That is one hundred percent my my ideas. They're just too convoluted for my own brain. Yeah. Yeah. And Ari and Ezreal with a cream just holding that thing together. The <laughs> kills from the Ari and the Ezreal. Are we allowed to say cream uh, on the stream? Is that allowed? We are allowed to say cream. It, 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 it's, it's a food. It's a food, man. True. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Look at this singed. He's taking a lot of damage right now. Trying to kite, get, let this Yasuo get in. But there's nothing that can be done. Twitch is, Twitch is dead. And now they're going to clean up. Oh, Malphite with the little... Oh, wait. Alistar, he's pretty low. Alistar's Ooh, the charm the into the damage. Wow. Oh. Bro, Bell in a bit too deep. Oh. Shen coming in with the, the ult with the shield. Wow. Here we go. I was going to say, how did he get so much two. shield? Mouth it's the goes down. Ult. He's back to half his health. This Alistar is not dying. He's not going oh. down, but the Mo I Levers think this is it. are. This might be it. Yeah, I don't think it's it. I think it's Nexus. I think Zed can try something real quick here. Oh my god, the stuns. Yeah. Never mind. Crazy stuns by the entirety of Superiority, and they're showing us why their name is Superiority right now. They're going for this Nexus at 14 minutes. They've turned the, the game around. They got an early loss last game, and they got an early win this one. Great job to bring it around, and we got a best of three, baby. All best of three. We didn't think we are going to see it, but, I mean, in that draft, we saw Mo Levers having a bit of fun there. We saw the Twitter, the, the Yasuo, and the Singe come through down in the bot lane. After that, it was kind of just like, yeah, okay, yeah, but, but less of our commercial creamy Oreo brick house <laughs> takes. Let's go over to the analysts to see what they say. Yeah, that was a game. That was a game of all time.